What is up guys? So today we are back to do some Kingdom Cup battles. Just a quick disclaimer, out of my team of six, as you can see here on top, uh, Bronzong definitely needs TM'd and Lucario definitely needs TM'd. Uh, unfortunately, I just... I just don't have the TMs, I'm sorry. Um, this is kind of the best I can do at the moment. So I felt like after I had one charge TM, I used it on Steelix. I felt like he was the easiest candidate to go for considering that um, he basically was a surefire shot, whereas I didn't need to waste any TMs on like Lucario trying to get Shadow Ball. I already have Power Punch, so I'm not super worried about what the second move is that I have. Um, unfortunately, I only got one charge TM in the last week, so I have just absolute horrible luck when it comes to using uh, TMs, unfortunately. I just, I have horrible luck getting them, and then I have horrible luck actually using them, so pretty, pretty crappy. So he is going to just pound away with some crunch and probably gonna hit me with some earthquake action here I'm actually just gonna let this uh, let this bronze on go away here not too worried at least we got some sweet damage in on the Steelix okay he's gonna save it right here towards the end no big deal hopefully uh, I was gonna say hopefully he just beats me down uh, but I don't think he uh, had enough help to quite pull off that ending there so I'm actually going to go ahead and throw out my Steelix here. Even though Lucario would be the preferred matchup because I would be doing super effective damage, I want to hold on to Lucario as the surprise pick, hoping to catch him off guard here. So he does go Lucario, which is A-OK. -okay. Going to try to get this Earthquake off. Just going straight for the big damage here. Hopefully he doesn't see this coming. Cool. He definitely saw it coming. Shield just didn't show up for me, as usual. I'm not going to block this first power-up punch, and I'm just going to try to get off. Okay, nothing. I won't get off anything there. So we'll go for the mirror match here. Unfortunately, it looks like this is going to be a quick and easy fight. He's going to definitely beat me here. No idea what his third Pokemon could be. Unfortunately, I'm literally going to get one shot and then I'll die. So he does have the Altaria, which is definitely favorable in his court. Unfortunately, yep, one hit and I'm done for. So, cool, so he leads with the Altaria. Pretty favorable for me here. Immediately switches, goes for the Lapras. Okay, um, definitely want to try to switch. Um, I'm going to save a little bit of health on my Steelix here. Definitely going to try to switch to Arcelio. I'm going to try to just output more damage than he can. Let's see if we can spam some Body Slam here. Going to try to tank some of this Surf damage. Come on! Get that body slam spam! It's crazy how good Celio can actually do up against Lapras here. It's pretty nuts to me. He's tanky. He has a ton of bulk whenever it comes to tanking that Surf. Pretty nuts. So did a pretty decent job. He does still have the Altaria. Ooh, he's got the Bastion on here. I don't know. I'm not gonna not gonna be able to do it. So mm, pretty much just gonna have to go with the Lucario here, hoping that he doesn't switch. Yeah, he's gonna switch. We're gonna go for the Steelix. Hold on to that as best we can. Try to get off some of these crunches here. I did try to store up a little bit of energy. Okay, so he blocks the first one. Not gonna block. I don't think I need to really block the sky attack. Didn't do quite enough damage for me to really warrant a block on that one. Whoo! This is gonna be interesting. This one's gonna be down to the wire. So blocked both of those. So he's out of shields. He's just gonna beat me down here. Can I? Nope. 
can't quite get to that crunch so oh definitely gonna block this John boy you killing me my man you killing me you got that sweet sweet lineup those good switches had a little bit of energy saved up there get rid of this Altaria and oh this is gonna be close oh boy no shields I might be screwed flamethrower And that, kids, is why you run the flamethrower. All right, back with another best of three. Back with John Boy again. Let's do some interesting stuff here. Let's try this. See how good the, uh, the Bronzong lead takes me again. What do we start with? Lucario. Not too shabby. Pretty, uh, pretty interesting matchup here. Use one shield, no more than that. It's not worth it. That shadow ball, whoo! All right, now we're just gonna whip out. Come on, I want this psychic to go off. And he's got Bastiod on again, okay. Not very effective at all, of course, but He's going to farm a little bit of energy here, so I know he's probably going to have at least Flamethrower. Just going to go with Blaziken. It's either going to be Flamethrower or uh, Stone Edge. Is that right? So we're going to use our other shield here to make sure we don't get rock damage to death. Yep, Stone Edge. So take away that. And we've got a little bit of energy saved up for the Altaria here. Unfortunately, uh, I definitely should have used Brave Bird. Definitely should have used Brave Bird there. It's all good. He blocked. No, no big deal. All right, so I still do have the Steelix. Kind of favorable for me, hopefully. That just raw damage output is insane. Okay, he does go for the Sky Attack. He does have one shield left, and he's got a lot of sky attacks built up here. He's probably going to take this. He is going to take it. My shield usage needs to get a lot better. Now, he's got that shield there. I think one more sky attack is going to bury me. It's going to bury me! I'm going down. Oh, <laughs> so close, so freaking close. Holy cow. Here we go. Starting with the Celio. Oh, cool, cool. I just luckily got that correct. I can charge up Body Slam super, super fast here. Firing off getting some of this sweet neutral damage not gonna waste any shields here It'd be interesting if maybe he had like dragon pulse or something uh, very very cool up against the Celio. at least it would end up doing some uh, better damage than surf or even an ice move would like ice beam or blizzard so going at it here I definitely feel like the Celio is a good pick. It's a good counter to Lapras. Um, it definitely fits in that specialty role, whereas Lapras is more of a broad, you know, it can tank a lot of different things. But uh, I definitely feel pretty secure in my pick with my Celio here. So you can see I didn't use a single shield the entire time and still came out on top for Lapras. Neither did he use any shields, but still, it's pretty nuts. So I just got deleted right there, which is insane. So we're gonna go with the Blaziken here, hoping to 
at least tie worst case scenario okay he does switch goes for the Altaria Whew. back to this matchup boy back to this oh man so I kind of want to save some shields for the Blaziken here considering that it's going to be really awkward when it comes down to uh, Blaziken and Lucario in the end or if the uh, the Altaria ends up taking out the Steelix here it's going to be kind of awkward. I may try to use one shield. I'm going to hold on to it. We'll try to use it on the next one if he doesn't just flat out beat me down on the next one. Hopefully he goes for the next, uh, ooh, bow shield's gone on him. I like that. If he uses it here, unless he's trying to just farm some energy, it looks like he's going for the energy farm. <sighs> Come on. Okay, that works. And we'll get one hit off on the Lucario maybe? Yeah. And then down to the, the freaking I'm just trying to use anything that I can not to get deleted here. Oh, whoo. oh, Blaziken. Blaziken feels really nice right now. I'm really digging the Blaziken. He's, uh, he's definitely clutch in a lot of situations. Like, super, super nice. Honestly, I'm feeling the Blaziken right now, so I think we may switch out our Celio and try to lead with Bronzong, finish with uh, Steelix and have Blaziken as our mid right here to kind of just fill out what we're going up against. So we'll go ahead and uh, send this over, see how this goes. Here we go, starting with Bronzong, he's got the Altaria, not too shabby of a matchup here. Gonna be doing comparable damage, but I think Dragon Breath is just gonna tear me apart here. Looks to be doing like loads more, but that orange bar can be a little deceiving. Gonna set up for the Psychic here, trying to not waste any of this energy. Ooh, that Psychic hits hard. I think actually having Psychic on my Bronzong here may be a little bit more effective in playing the mind game because I don't think people are going to be expecting it. I think they're going to be looking for the Heavy Slam. I don't necessarily know that I even want to purchase a second move. I could honestly, uh, I'd have to waste a couple of rare candies on it, but, oh this sucks. But um, we can uh, we can try. I mm, he is what a running water gun. I may have wanted to go with uh, Blazik in there. Neither one was a really great matchup. Unfortunately, uh, did not think to uh, cover myself for the Lapras here. Ugh, kind of sucks. But here we go. Let's do it. Pushing out some uh, mediocre damage here. That surf is just so spammy. I don't know what to do against it. Look at it! <sighs> Lapras is gonna kill me, yeah. He's, he's seeing it now, he's like, oh, okay. All right, let's see what we got. I got no shields, he's got one shield, so. Ooh, Alolan Marowak, interesting. So, gonna go with the Brave Bird here, hopefully doing something. He shielded it, not bad. Hopefully I can get to another one though. He's just resisting tons and tons of my fi fighting damage though. Yeah, so that's gonna be it. Not too shabby. Alolan Marowak was uh, kind of the other candidate as to which one to run besides Blaziken. I definitely am feeling the Blaziken a little bit more right now, but Alolan Marowak is still really, really good. Let's try to lead with Celio, have Lucario as our flexor there. Let's. You know what? We haven't used Altaria much today. Let's use some Altaria here. And here we go. Ooh, the Lucario matchup. Risky business leading with Lucario, but definitely going to work out for him here. Uh, let's see. Going to go with the Altaria here. Unfortunately, he is going to be able to uh, switch out and yeah, go for something favorable in his matchup. Unfortunately, I'm kind of stuck here. Um, maybe not a Lolan Marowak could have been the best option. 
could have been something a little different. Come on. Send it out. Shoot it on. Push it through. You got this. Keep it going. What are you doing? Go! All right, so after that weird hiccup, uh, we're gonna restart that uh, that last battle here. So I am down one game against uh, Mr. Silent Style here. So let's go back. Looks like he's just gonna use the exact same team, which is exactly what I did, so good on him. Very good sportsmanship. I'm gonna charge up to a body slam there, go for this uh, Altaria possibly be giving him another chance to Ooh, he's gonna play it a little differently this time so I don't want to shield our first power up punch not gonna be pushing too much damage let's go try to okay so he's going Altaria so gonna just fire off this dragon pulse hopefully uh, he doesn't shield this probably will yep he called it not too shabby so gonna end up losing this Altaria here just gonna try to force another shield maybe hopefully he thinks I had enough shield sword or enough energy sorted good good got both of his shields out of the way now unfortunately <sighs> gonna have to go with the uh, good old Celio here with this ice damage hopefully able to uh, push out enough I want to save save some of this energy that I have stored up because I can farm quite a bit of body slam off of this matchup right here I don't it's not worth it to use both shields if he if he kills me he kills me yeah so not too shabby there unfortunately I'm gonna lose quite a bit of health off of that and let's see here he's probably just gonna go Lucario again oh no Alolan Marowak not too shabby uh, unfortunately I don't have uh, I do not have the fabled <sighs> shadow ball so I'm just gonna pretty much get deleted here yet again so cool I really do need shadow ball on a uh, good old Lucario here but unfortunately no TMs and I may get to raid a little bit before then but honestly not much so good games my dude very good matchups there good calls good uh, good switching I like it I like where you're at alright so switching over to a new opponent here going to be going up against Fox Villain and I don't know exactly how I want to run this um, actually I'm thinking that's pretty strong ooh double bronze on so this is going to be interesting uh, he's probably going to have the upper hand here uh, considering he probably has the right charge moves, which I do not. So I'm just going to uh, put out a little bit of damage here. And then, man, I don't really have anything that's like preferred here. Um, you know what? Let's just, let's just go with, let's just roll with it. Let's just see how far we can drag down the rabbit hole with two Bronzongs using some freaking not very effective moves on each other constantly. No sense in holding out and using any shields here. It's just, it's not going to be worth it. He's getting to his heavy slams really f a lot faster than I can get to freaking Psychic here. <sighs> Interesting that we both chose Bronze Song. Uh, very, very cool. Uh, he's going to have a heavy slam saved duh. Oh, he's using it. Uh, I definitely probably would have just farmed that energy and held on to it for the next Pokemon because I probably would have ended up shielding it straight off the bat. So get a little bit of Altaria action in here, see what he's got packing for me. Come on. Goes for the Lucario. Interesting. That's an interesting pick. Maybe... Yeah, there you go. Maybe, uh... Lucario and Blaziken actually aren't either one is kind of iffy considering that I'm going to be able to resist a ton of that damage not too worried about uh, it's either going to be a flying move or a fighting move so yeah flying moves definitely the uh, the way to go there trying to uh, do some neutral damage at least 
instead of trying to do some fighting moves that can be resisted. So I did get him to burn both shields, so not too shabby there. Gonna lead out with, uh, ooh, unfortunately this is gonna be bad. Yeah. Okay, let's see how this goes. Get rid of that. And he can literally just beat me down with fast moves right here. This is gonna be really crappy. Really crappy. Get to this water pulse. Get to this water pulse. Holy cow! Why? Why do you do this to me? Both of those. Ah. Oh, it's not gonna do enough damage. I already know it's not gonna do enough damage. Oh! Wow! So, oh, you can definitely see uh, Lucario's defenses are extremely low. Holy cow! That was that was so close. Starting out so boring, ending so climactic. That was super super cool. Ooh, both having the same stroke of genius, are we? Not too shabby, let's see how we can do here. See who can force the other one to switch. Oh, I wonder how much IVs are gonna come into play here. Maybe get a shield? Yeah. Not bad, not bad. Now, do I want a shield? Yeah, I think I'm gonna shield. <laughs> Just to be on the safe side here, I definitely don't want to uh, see what he has a little too late okay switching it out going for the steelix not too bad not too bad gonna do some little dragon pulse here hopefully getting off some decent damage okay not too bad i'm uh, just gonna kind of let the altaria die here and hmm he's gonna have the energy advantage for sure Go with, let's go with Steelix here. Yeah, see, so I knew he was going straight for it. He's got that crunch. I'm gonna be working towards an earthquake as quickly as possible, seeing how quick we can get that off. Both of these are just gonna be, so we got the mirror matches over and over. He shouldn't be at an earthquake. How did it, what? That was so fast. How was that so fast? Holy cow. So he must have had just a tiny bit saved up from after that crunch. Not too bad. So we're basically just mirror matching. If he ends up having a freaking Lucario, I'm gonna die. Cause we chose the exact, <laughs> exact same lineup, dude. Holy cow. How in the world does that happen? Strokes of genius definitely on the same canvas here holy cow that's amazing so I might not have switched there because the Lucario matchups would have been pretty even um, the Alterio while it would have resisted it just didn't have enough health to really withstand any of the damage holy cow that was amazing that was that was awesome coming off of these recent battles I'm kind of feeling Kind of feeling this lineup, honestly. Starting with the Altaria and Lucario matchups, so pretty favorable for me. Lucario is a risky lead; it does pay off really, really good whenever it works. But whenever it doesn't work, it doesn't work, unfortunately. So, gonna get a little bit of power punch right there. Let's see here, try to bait some shields. How bad he wants this Lucario bad right now. Hold on to it there. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll use one shield for the Lucario. I don't wanna use too much, yeah. Kind of expected to uh, try to take some, some damage there. So do you wanna use both of your shields? No, good, 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 okay. So let's see what we've got with Lucario out of the mix. I'm not, not super worried about the Altaria there. I do have my 
Good old Celio, right? Okay, I did choose that. So, got the Celio, whipping it out here, using it up against the Altaria. Gonna be spamming some Body Slam. Uh, I, I wish I would have hit the, the button to get it to work. There it is. Okay, so spamming some Body Slam here. Let's get some Body Slam. Nice. Expecting that uh, that ice move there really does, uh, does a number on the mind games. So let's put this Altaria to rest. Goodbye, Altaria. Thank you, thank you. And the Flygon. Very interesting. Very, very cool. Definitely going to stay on this Celio train as long as I can here because this ice type damage is going to be really good. This water type damage will at least be neutral. Yeah. Yeah. That Celio, man. It's doing work, man. He's actually pretty nice. I'm, I'm really liking him. Leading with the Lucario, man, that's that's a risky move. I'm I'm proud. I'm kind of proud. You've got you got some spunk. So we're gonna end up just kind of. Uh, I'm gonna save a little bit of health on the Bronzong here. Yeah, I shouldn't have you know did the first one, but hey, don't want to use both shields though for sure be okay there. Let's just go with the Lucario. We will kind of delete his Lucario there and I am completely prepared. Oh. Interesting because now I'm, ooh, forced him to switch though with the Altaria. Interesting. Interesting switch, my man. Try to push out some damage here. Pushing for, he knows I don't have an Ice type move now, so Pushing for any type damage that I can. Oh, kind of don't want to use it. Ugh, not not quite enough. So, go for this extra body slam here. Hopefully, hopefully doing a little bit of damage. No. Nope. Yep, and kind of just getting taken off there. And this is going to be kind of rough. Hopefully, being able to get a little bit. Of damage boost here up against the Blaziken can help probably not it's probably just gonna be yep crazy so <laughs> the Blaziken as you saw whether it's me using it or somebody else using it against me it's it's doing some nice work it is definitely a good anti Bastiodon anti Lucario pick Ooh, glad I gambled there just a little bit. All right, so immediately switching, going to the Flygon, okay. Uh, I don't have anything for the Flygon, unfortunately, but uh, Flygon is the worst of the dragons to go up against the dragons, so I'll let him use this mud, oh, okay. He got it, he got it. I, I thought he would have, you know, automatically chose to uh, use the, uh, the, the mud shot or stone edge or Whichever one it is, I can't remember at the moment. So let's uh, get rid of that there. <sighs> what do you got for me? What do you got? So an Altaria, definitely just gonna try to see if I can bait a shield. Unfortunately, okay. Don't have anything big to really use. Most of this is gonna get shielded here. So can I get, no, not, not, not. Uh -uh. Go for the Steelix here, securing Hopefully, some good damage against the Altaria. Got a Crunch. Okay, Crunch doing some work. Um, nah, not, not too worried about the Sky Attack right now. Pushing out some damage. I, I kind of just want to farm this energy here. I'm not even going to get enough. Yeah, Crunch right there at the end. So let's see what we've got. The Blaziken. Hmm. <laughs> so he does have one shield. Hmm. Ooh. Not bad. Not bad. Definitely may have not caught that bluff there at the end, but definitely. So that is actually it for our Kingdom Cup battles, guys. Hopefully, 
uh, you guys are just as prepared, if not, actually I hope you're way more prepared for the, uh, the Kingdom Cup than I am because I don't feel like I'm as prepared as I should be. Uh, for the Tempest Cup, I definitely feel like I was a little bit more prepared than I am today, but I'll rock with what I got. I'm not, I'm not kind of scared to just go in and just do what I got, you know, I'm not, it is what it is. But thank you guys so much for hanging out. This is probably an extremely long video showcasing all of these uh, battles is kind of a time consuming type deal. But thank you guys so much for hanging out. And remember that if you like to like videos, you should probably do that. Otherwise, you could be that guy and hit the other button. But nonetheless, if you have anything to say, make sure you say it down in those comments below. And until our next video, I will catch you then.